for the little crookedness of this tripod but it's just gonna have to do i'm sorry this little slanted i'm sorry welcome back <laughs> welcome to my channel you guys if you're new here my name is rana cache i'm 21 years old i'm a college student and content creator i just do a whole bunch of different stuff so welcome um if you're an og then you know this this is a little familiar i'm gonna break it down to y'all so boom in full transparency, this is my mom's house. I'm back home. Um, and I want to let you guys know what went down and what transpired and what led to this. So, moving out is incredibly expensive. If no one's ever told you that, it is. Um, and so, when I moved out, you know, I had my P I was on my P's and Q's. I saved up a lot of money when I moved out. And I was fine for a while, but then I got into a car accident. Um, I got into a relationship and relationships are expensive and moral of the story is through all of that you know I was like not working for five months and then started working again and just like a bunch of different life changes occurred to the point that it was like you know it's giving kind of living paycheck by paycheck and I don't like that I, don't, I like to have a little bit of breathing room I like to travel you guys know that so with that being said um I looked at the classes that I have left for the uh, for graduation and I decided okay most of these can be a lot of these can be taken online that scared me as so my car was squeaking but a lot of these courses can be taken online so I went ahead and put together a course schedule that I can take online and I said you know what save money live better so this spring semester I'm gonna come home and then I'm gonna go back to finish my last semester in the fall so we're at home for spring semester i'm doing online courses and i have one semester left so i hope that caught you a little bit up more with everything that's been going on in my life i like being transparent with y'all like let's be real here the average content creator typically like those tiktok stars some of the smaller youtubers they're not making enough money to just live off of content creation and it's a lot when you're a college student and you're also working to provide for yourself and to get an apartment in this economy with these inflated prices like my apartment i was paying 1390 a little over 1400 dollars after all the fees and stuff every single month that is a lot of money a lot of responsibility and so with that being said it was time to come home it's fine it's absolutely fine like it's okay if you still live with your mom if you move back home after you moved out i feel like i just want to put that out there for people who think like me and they think you know me coming back home is like a setback it's like a failure and it's not it's just a way to save more money a way to be more financially responsible um and a way to just set you up for an even better and even bigger uh comeback if you will yeah there's that oh if i haven't already said a happy first day everyone like 
even though it's technically one of me technical my first day was yesterday but i take online courses i did pretty much just spend yesterday looking at the syllabi and like putting all of the assignments into my notion so this semester i am taking five courses i'm taking com 300 written communication com 449 promotional writing uh english 375 heaven hell and judgment very interesting i don't know how that's gonna play out English 381, Film Directors, and Nutrition 110, or NTR 110, which is Nutrition and Practice. Um, some of these had prerequisites, so I'm just, you know, following the course. Some of these are just, uh, like, I need a certain amount of communications credit, so I decided which communications course I was going to take. Like, when it comes to just planning my schedule out, I'm very premeditated with everything. Like, this stuff was already planned out, like, a whole year ago. Like, all the classes I'm going to take... Some things change here and there based on like course availability and like wait lists and all the other stuff but for the most part all of this has been planned out ahead of time. And this semester I'm actually taking 13 credits. Um, next semester is going to be a little bit more than this semester just because I can only take so much online. A lot of people are moving back to in person which I don't understand with RSV, COVID, the flu on the rise right now like you should always have online courses as an option just considering what we've gone through as a community as like a nation like you just should have that option available because of everything going on but yeah i'm taking 13 credits this semester all online i'm really excited so far so good like all the courses are pretty smooth sailing like i feel like i'm really knowledgeable on a lot of the information already so it feels like easy a this semester and that's what i'm looking forward to because next semester is going to be i think 16 credits but that's my last semester so you know, hopefully everything goes according to plan because I'm ready to get up. I'm ready to get out. <laughs> ready to get this degree and get it pushing. Yeah, I will try to do more content on school and stuff because this is my last year of school. And I feel like there's so much more I could be putting you guys onto. So many more gyms I could be dropping for you guys. All, you know, 30 of you. Whoever watches this, like, at the end of the day, I feel like if I've never made it apparently clear, getting monetization and stuff for my videos was never essentially the giant giant like end goal here i create content because i want to look back on my life and i want to look at the progress i've made and i want to have something to show my future children and like other generations and if it helps you it helps you and i really would hope it inspires you or helps you in life but ultimately it's more like a a time capsule if you will just like what's the word discography of my life like just like my top greatest moments i guess and it's just fun filming and editing for you guys like like i really do appreciate the people who still watch me who continue to watch me who the new people who have joined this channel because i really like i don't know i really appreciate just chilling and talking to you guys you guys are like a little little circle you know and it's just fun so <laughs> but pretty much yeah that's what's going on right now i am taking a little breaky break from my courses right now but i already finished like two assignments like we knocking it out this is why i love online courses a asynchronous courses to be exact because you can do it whenever you want to um as long as you turn in the stuff by the deadlines you're fine if you want to you can zoom through and be in week five on week two if you want to but that's od i am gonna try to exclusively do work monday through friday so I don't have to worry about doing work on the weekends and I can have that to myself. Um, but we'll see how everything goes. But for right now, this is like a long little monologue. I just wanted to catch you guys up on everything because I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in a really long time. And I do apologize about that. It's just life be life in. Like I was working a 9 to 5 that I wasn't very happy with. It was making decent money but it was like... Uh, and I'll definitely upload a video on that, you know, my little job videos, y'all seem to love those. So I'm definitely going to upload a video on what it was like being like a dental receptionist. But for the most part, just constantly working and working on my relationship and my personal mental health and my personal health. Like, I had taken a really long hiatus from the gym for a second. And then I got back into the gym and then it was like not the same after the car accident um, because my back got injured. And then it's like that, got to argue with people about my back and like, it's just so much going on. Life really be life. Like, I feel like when you get older, so much just happens. Like, and it's in the blink of an eye. I'm about to be 22 in literally like two months. That is crazy. That is insane. But anyways, yeah, I'm going to upload more. 
Um, definitely because I have more time this semester, I'm thinking about just doing odds and ends here and there, like little side hustles and stuff, just so I can focus more on my schoolwork, and my mental health, because I feel like I had a really tough year last year. And I'm just praying for 2024 to be soft for me, to be good for me. Um, but I'm going to continue doing my work, and then I'm probably going to film me making dinner. Tonight we're making a uh, homemade chipotle which is one of my specialties and i love making it because i used to be an avid chipotle girly but they just kind of fell off so we're gonna make it at home all right i'll talk to you guys later bye <laughs>